Hey everyone, thanks for stopping by. Today we're gonna to be making this Mexican rice. Super quick, super easy, super tasty. Let's get started. Okay, right here I have two cups of jasmine rice. Although I do believe long grain works better for this. But I'm going to add it to a pan that I have about two to three tablespoons of olive oil in. And this is on a medium high heat. Now right away I wanna hurry up and mix all of my rice so that it's coated in the oil. Now we're gonna toast this rice for about 10 minutes. This is about the five minute mark right here. And you're looking for a nutty smell and you're looking for this darker color right here. You can see some of them are a little more brown than the others. This is about what you're looking for. So now I'm gonna add one can of tomato paste, six ounces. You can do it with a half a can too, but I really like that tomato pop. Now when you add your tomato paste, you have to be super quick. You can't let it sit, otherwise it will burn. You gotta move it around really, really quick. You can also take this off the fire to do that if it makes you uncomfortable. Now there goes the spice blend, and that is garlic, onion, paprika, cumin, salt and pepper, and brown sugar. And right here, I have four cups of stock, and any stock will work. I prefer chicken, but today all I had was beef. And don't forget guys, all of the measurements, ingredients, instructions, tips and tricks will be in the description down below. So now this is the point where you really have to taste your broth and make sure that it has a really good flavor. You may need to add more salt right here. And it's important because that's how your rice is gonna taste. So after you bring it up to a boil, channel your inner chef, John, and add a little cayenne. If you're feeling brave, you do not have to do that, but it was a last minute thing, I wanted a little. And now after I added my cayenne in, you're gonna go ahead and cover your pan and you're going to knock the heat down to really super low and you're gonna simmer for 20 minutes. And that's what it looks like 20 minutes later. And now you just wanna fluff your rice. You could use a fork or my method, under and over, under and over. <laughs> and that's it guys, Mexican rice, super easy. So don't forget, like, comment, share, and subscribe, and come back to my kitchen anytime.